What's up guys and welcome to the tarot. I am an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the three what's for somebody. Some of you guys are going to be dealing with an Aries or a Scorpio. Gemini. What's up Jimmy Jams? Thank you so much for being here. I hope you guys are doing beautifully well today. So we're going to do the three what's. We're going to see what happened. Um, what's happening now, what's going to happen. Clarify and then I'll give you some advice. Okay. So I know I've been MIA. <laughs> I've been moving um and the move went good it was just like once I got here my wi-fi wasn't wi fi and I had no wi-fi for a few days um which really put me in a rut <laughs> because I couldn't post on my YouTube and um YouTube is literally like me doing these videos literally makes me peaceful it makes me I just love doing this okay and if I can't do it, it like puts me in a funk, a really freaking funk. Um, and I was so upset. I was like, universe, why is this happening? <laughs> um, but I'm happy that it did because things came up that I had to like take care of. And it would have been a lot if I was recording and having to do all of that at the same time. So I'm actually kind of grateful. It's like everything, everything happened. Everything started like working and meshing well at the perfect time. Like it was crazy. But so I was um, guided to share my experience with you guys. So this could be that if there's some type of delays happening in your life, don't worry. The universe is doing it on purpose. There's some things that you might not see that you're going to have to deal with. Okay. And um, they're just like, you know, it's like somebody, it's like somebody like holding you back because they see a car coming, you know, while you're about to cross the road or something like that. Okay. All right. Gemini. Let's see. Can we do with a Leo? So what happened was the five of pentacles in reverse, the nine of wands in reverse. That's the seven of wands in reverse. The three of cups and the star in reverse. Come dealing with an Aquarius. You stop fighting for something that um, you once thought you wanted. Okay. Um, I feel like you, you're better without it. To be honest, I, I and I feel like you were celebrating as well. Two of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, it was like, finally, this is out of my space. Finally, I can stop, you know, being, trying to fight for this. Okay, what's happening now, though, is a Six of Wands in reverse. So I feel like something is not working out how you thought. Doesn't mean that you made the wrong choice. Don't think that whatsoever. Um, we're going to clarify. What's, ha what's going to happen is a Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Abundance for a fail man. Yeah. I told you, you didn't make the wrong choice. Bottom one deck is a Temperance in, in Reversa. So there's something within you that is not, that does not feel right. I feel like it's because you're trying to, it's because you're trying to ignore healing something. You could feel guilty about something, but you, you're good like heal it so you can move on what is this five of pentacles in reverse the seven of wands in reverse the star in reverse and the three of cups you have the ace of swords in reverse and the knight of wands so i feel like it you weren't it wasn't i wasn't a hundred percent clear why you had to um like stop fighting for this but i feel like it felt good <clears throat> It's like you just knew that this is the way to go, the four of coins. Yeah, because I feel like you were holding on to it for too long. And then you get a little taste of what it of what it felt, you not holding on to it. And you wanted to go after that feeling because you felt so free, so liberated. What is the six of wands here in reverse for what's happening now? Yeah, the five of coins, the king of wands, the eight of coins, and the seven of cups. Um, I feel like you thinking that something is not working is a delusion. It's it's not what it seems. Okay. I feel like you something is working a lot better than what you think. It's just not physically being shown to you. Because I feel like you're still in this five of um pentacles energy where you're just like, oh, I just lost this. Oh, I don't have this. Oh, I don't have that. You're still thinking about the things that you don't have. You have to think about the things that are are working for you. Um and you have to understand that you just finished, you just got out of a situation that you were fighting for, for a very long time. You know what I'm saying? And it's like, you might, there might be some lack, there might be some things that you're experiencing that you don't have, but so what? Look at what you still do have. You know what I'm saying? Whenever we stop fighting for something, whenever we give up on something, whenever we release something, we're always going to experience a loss. You're always going to have to, you know what I'm saying? It's like moving. 
right? Like you're always going to have to start from scratch. You're always going to have to reinvent your situation or, you know, do the goals differently. You know, it's going to take you some time to get furniture and all this stuff, you know? So it's like, at least you got a crib, right? Like look at it like that, right? You have the eight of coins here and you're going to have to put in work in order for something to get back to the status and the whatever that you want wanted it to here but it's possible don't tell yourself that it's not and just because something is not moving in the way that you want to does not mean that it's not happening or that it's going to happen you're just gonna have to put a little elbow grease you know what i'm saying you're gonna have to scrub the corners of the crib to make it look nice you know and and, and these are if this is delays too like this could be i just got right now like Let's just say you bought a new house, right? And it's a lot of cleaning to do and you don't really want to do it. So you're calling the cleaning people and it's like the cleaning people are not coming or they say they're going to come and they don't come or, you know, a lot of delays coming with that. Maybe the universe wants you to clean your own crib. <laughs> I don't know. Maybe you have to put some work into the situation in order for it to be as successful as you want it to be. Because if it's not as successful as you want it to be, you know what they say? Sometimes you got to just get it done yourself. This could be that type of energy. Sometimes you just got to get it done yourself, you know? And um, what's going to happen with the Ten of Pentacles? Can you clarify? You have the King of Cups in reverse with the Five of Cups here. So what's going to happen is you're going to gain some type of stability, some type of financial abundance coming in here. And someone's going to um, be upset about that. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio doesn't have to be though or Sagittarius but somebody's gonna be upset about that okay and someone's going to be like oh but you know you left me out and blah, 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 and this is not fair for me and blah, 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 blah. like this is just somebody like cry me a freaking river bro like this is just what I'm getting and not that I'm being insensitive towards this person but this person is is, is coming off like why me why not me too like, bro, go get yours. Like, Gemini had to go get theirs. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's giving, it's giving, this could be the person that you stop fighting for. And then when things start looking up for you, they're like, well, things should be looking up for me too. And why, and why aren't they? It's like somebody wants you to feel bad for them, but don't. We should never feel bad for anyone. I had to learn that the hard way. Um, I still give people the benefit of the doubt to this day, but I don't feel bad or try to help people who are in situations that they're refusing to get themselves out of. Because we all have free will. We can all do what needs to get done to do it. Is it going to be the easiest? No. But does it mean that we, doesn't mean that it's impossible. Doesn't mean that the option isn't there. A lot of people just want the easy route. And if anything in this planet was easy, there will be no reason for us to be here. We come here to learn and to become better souls and evolve. And the only way to do that is to learn, is to grow, is to go through challenges and get out of it and become stronger and Take that, you know, on the next life lesson, whatever. And there could be somebody here who wants things to, they want to be cradled. They want to be, oh, it's okay. I'm sorry, but that's not life. And I feel like you letting this person know what's up is going to teach them. And it's going to make them want to realize, okay, I have to wake up and put a pep in my step. That's why I always tell people, create boundaries and don't be scared to. Because even though it might not feel good, you are showing the other person what they need to work on without you even trying. And that's, we're all supposed to be helping each other here. That's part of this process. Anyway, that's all that I have for you, Gemini. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.